where today we're driven into Rome. This is season two, episode six. We are almost done with Rome. Finally, guys, we are back on Rome. Just so you guys are, are aware, Rome is one of the hardest shows for me to edit. So if I go through this and I edit the holy hell out of it, please know that it's because of the studio. It is not because of me, but they're very aggressive. So if you would like to see this in a full reaction, you can join the channel on my second and third tier. It will be available for my YouTube channel members, as well as my second and third tier on my other platforms platform, Patreon. So please sign up to one of those platforms today and help support Dandres Array channel. So this show is one of my favorite shows, although the um, it's very hard to not get copyrights on it, but it's a very good show for me to watch and you guys to join me. I've been having the most, the greatest time ever. The greatest time ever! Um, but yes, so now it seems like Octavian has made a deal with Anthony, um, and I'm kind of happy about it because I didn't want Anthony to die and it just makes sense for the moment for Octavian to do this because he has some other people to take care of. That old lady, if she don't die soon, like, I swear I'm gonna get upset. So I'm ready to jump into this episode, guys, and to see what's going to happen. I'm here for the ruckus. I'm here for the noise. With that being said, guys, let's jump into Rome. It's not exactly what Rome has got to give. Where are the grain provisioning figures? This can't be right. I've been talking with the men. They had no idea Greece was so large. We were plotting our revenge. You must find good ground. We'll bury your nose in quartermaster's accounts. You must expect to be gloomy. I see only a hundred thousand mouths to feed. We ride with these men to save the Republic. Before we do any saving of Republics, we have Octavian to defeat. Something gall. We play this right. We can take Brutus and Cassius by surprise. So when both our armies arrive in Greece, they will be trapped. Right. Sam, what I'm saying, or shall I speak more slowly? <laughs> no. There is a list of the most prominent friends and supporters of Brutus and Cassius left in Rome. We should kill them. These are among the finest men in Rome. Some of them are good friends. General Anthony, tell them. Cicero is the cleverest bastard of them all, and he has the largest network of spies. He must die first. Ah! No. You will remain behind with a small force. Add instructions telling him to divide the names among the gangs. Rufus Tranquillus. Who? Who? Isn't he father to Octavia's friend Jocasta? I don't like the girl. She's a bad influence. Woe unto Rufus Tranquillus, then. Make sure Varinus knows that he and Titus Pullo should deal with Cicero personally. To cut off his hands and nail them to the Senate door. Nobody can possibly say that I don't keep my word. I shall miss you. We're forever saying goodbye. It's becoming tiresome. When you return, you must bring me Brutus's head as a wedding present. He's using... Yeah. You be careful with Octavian. Of course. I know how to handle him. That's what I'm afraid of. There, see? Brings out your eyes. What? Wash that off at once. Yes, Father. You stay away from my daughter. Mascius, tell the collegiate captains we meet here today. He's captain, she's his daughter. He says don't paint her. Don't fucking paint her. Spoken like a true third man. But be careful, slave. I have my limits. <laughs> You've been given license to kill them and then to take of theirs what you and your men can carry. What gives you the right to decide who gets what? The list has been equally divided. You all get your fair share. Try to keep them out of the mud. I will, Father. I can find bad to have it. Get out of the mud! Lucius! <laughs> That's the one. Excuse me, lady. Is this the way to the temple of... Bye. Bye, you don't talk. Bye. Fuck yourself, you fuck! There's more than enough here for everyone. Which of you has ever seen so much money for the taking? What shall we do with all this wealth? The Feast of Pomona is coming soon. It used to be that each collegium would distribute fish and bread to the people. Then the people will begin to see the collegia is more than purveyors of violence and fear. But that is what we are. Thank you for the history lesson, but that was the old days. The right. collegia must change. 
or they'll die. The Aventine will be honoring Pomona with fish and bread. You can spend your money as you wish. Make us look bad. For that, you need no help from me. We shall be charitable. We shall be large. Let us feed the people by all means. Goodwill. I don't trust it. Who's that guy? He's a man of vision, Carter. A man of vision. And? It's done. You'll take care of Cicero, eh? He's at his villa in Tusculum. They want it done quick. Where are you going? Not your business. Just trying to be friendly. It's a good game. Ah, uh -huh. what's wrong with her? <laughs> You'll find yourself some other fool to play with. He doesn't see What you want? Where are you going? A bit of work. Why don't you come along? It's a lovely country where I'm going. Don't go. <laughs> I'll be back before you know it. Good luck. Ha! It's my middle name. I've just spoken to someone in Anthony's camp. I think your secrets will be safe with Hex. You're out with it. Damn, he's not gonna get him. Fabian and Anthony are reconciled. Their two armies are united. Those armed men are at the door. You must retreat to Asia before the trap is sprung. On your life, you must get this letter to Brutus under sad. On your life. Yes, sir. What is your name, young man? Titus Pullo, sir. Talk about famous. Everyone's heard of Cicero. Your work today will earn you immortality. There's no way. I can dissuade you from your task, I suppose. Normally I'd be tempted, but you're far too important. Imagine the fuss. I get back and I haven't done my job. So put your weapon down. Never. Don't mess about. I haven't got all day. If you could see how absurd you look, <laughs> you would not protest. Give me a few moments. Whenever you're ready. I'm sure his people is escaped or something. Mind if I pick some peaches? Oh, yes. Take what you want. All right. Resume your hideous wailing when I'm gone. Everything will be all right. Yes, must. <laughs> Does he have teeth? I'm just curious. Easiest if you kneel. <laughs> you might not want to watch this. I mean no disrespect, but it seems a shame she'll never have a family of her own. But she could marry, if you would let her. What kind of man would marry a prostitute? God. No man that she deserves. <laughs> Fuck you and your fucking mongrels. Get out my way! Does he have that? <laughs> Marinus, no! He dropped it. Get back to your game. You stay out of this road. Nobody saw that piece of paper. He's not a bad fella, that Cicero. Oh. Not stuck up like you might think. I'm mad that nobody was like, what, where did you get that paper from? More names from Mark Anthony. More. Surely we have killed enough. Close on a thousand men. Agrippa has a point. We should proceed more slowly. Excuse me. I need some air. Long day. Very long. Killing people, even defenseless ones. <laughs> it's not pleasant work, but it's necessary. No You've problem. been avoiding me. I thought it best. Why? I think if you did actually love me as you said, you wouldn't mind any amount of awkwardness. Cannot have mistaken my sincerity. But to avoid awkwardness? My father was a nobody. His father was a slave. You'll not be married to the commendable son of a nobody. I'll marry who I like. No, you'll marry some useful nobleman of your brother's choosing. I've been torturing myself these last months. I cannot bear to... Don't. Oh, I like this guy. Hello, Octavia. My senus, I came to see my brother. Agrippa, we can't find the wretched blasted figures for the blasted tax projection. Lovely to see you again. He's handsome in a really awkward way. What guarantee is there that our money buys the influence we seek? Ensure that Rome recognizes him as king of Judea? Herod will be in our debt. We will not disburse the money until the conflict is settled. Conspire in bribery 
so that idolaters can rule over your own people. The one we know. One we can work with. Why let any of them rule? This is our land. We are the sons of Arod from the families of Manasseh. We are the wrath of Israel. What joy it is to have your strength at my side. We are the chosen people. Not slaves, not animals. The chosen people. Uh, what's going on? See? Orderly as you like. When it takes all, you reckon? I reckon. I reckon. Well, the concern's here. There'll be peace soon, one way or another. A good thing. I suppose. Violence is the only trade I know. Peace comes and the collegiate change, as you say they must. Well, I'll be on my ass again, won't I? It's good to see you so happy and full of purpose again. It oh, is. Some bad stuff to happen, I know it. You can see it on my tombstone now. Second man on the Aventine. He handed out many fish. I'm a soldier. Just like I used to. Second hour. Are oh, we blind? We should go. Are you sure you're all right? I'll be fine. And once you're gone, I'm sure I should be fine. I don't want to leave you like this. Go! He really loves her. Good job, girl. You got a good one. If only for my sake, be good to Antony. I'm pledged to it, honey. He's an arrogant shit, I know, but he's a good and honest man. Must be way soon. Where is Agrippa? I don't know. Father! Saying about some woman, I expect. I'm superior. It will only provoke him. It provokes everybody. You all know how clever you are. No one needs reminded. I'm so sorry. Hot from a brothel bed on such a day. Shame on you, Agrippa. I'm teasing me. It's fine. We should go. Sorry I'm late. It was women's troubles. Had to go to the temple. The place was a madhouse. <laughs> he knows. They ride it real slow. So now you can tell me all about Agrippa. How long have you two been lovers? Please don't lie to your mother. You know it's futile. <laughs> How did you know? I didn't until now. Oh! Both you and Agrippa have good reason to be discreet. Don't be thinking you can go off and marry him someday because it's not going to happen. I love him. Soft as cheese. What am I going to do with you? Who's Please that? help me! Her father! I beg you help! All my family are dead! They killed them and took me away! Of course. We'll protect you. Wow. Kill the whole family. Hey. Just said hey back then? <laughs> Not the biggest shocker of the show. Like fish, did they? Your lot? I didn't know that. What is the helmet for? Nothing. Soldiers leaving. You mean me? Leaving with them? <laughs> no. If I was to go back in now, I'd probably be first spear at least. Leg it even. Probably buy a leg. <laughs> be a short campaign. Everyone says so. I'm pregnant. That's not pregnant wrong. I'm pregnant. Oh, I didn't get Pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> this is my father's signet ring. Enemy is sighted. At last. It's not just Octavian, sir. Mark Antony is with him. Master the men. We must break camp and begin the retreat immediately. Now wait, stop. Now do nothing. We will not retreat. Old friend, this no. is no more running. And if we are to die, this is as good a place as any. We have the upper ground. As he says. Ooh. Heavens, I entirely forgot. Today's your birthday, isn't it? Happy, Happy birthday. Well, there's no cake. I shan't forget. Mm. No cinnamon. Makes me sneeze. If you need to urinate, now would be the time. I'm fine. Thank you. This is how history is made. I like his outfit. Advance! Do you like the honor? No, no. You do it by all means. Advance! I like his voice better. What is happening? Do you know? No idea. <laughs> when in doubt, <laughs> attack! <laughs> no! The two on me! Stop! Yes, sir! Oh my God! 
Sir, Anthony's forces have broken the line. Our right flank is gone. Send in the reserve cohort. Happy birthday. What happened? We must fall back immediately. All right. Come, old friend. We have to move. We must go. Uh, it has been an honor and a pleasure leading you. And I am sorry we could not do better. Give my best to my mother. Tell her. Tell her something suitable. the head packed in salt for transportation back to Rome. People appreciate the little touches, I find. Ooh. Well, well. I actually started crying at the end of that. That was very, very sad. I didn't think I really cared until actually it happened. And then I was like, damn. That's really sad. Um, now I just can't wait for the mother to get it. Maybe I'll cry even when she dies, um, if she dies on screen. So everybody is pretty much dead. At first I was getting really upset because I thought that the, the scroll that that man wrote was gonna actually get to Octave, um, whatever their names are. Um, but thankfully it didn't. And then this happens, womp, womp, womp. You know what I feel? I think what's going to happen is Mark Anthony is gonna try to pull one over Octavian. I think that's gonna be the big Thing by the end of the season because now we now everything is like literally all is, everything is settled I think what's gonna happen is Octavian's gonna become see he's gonna be in control of Rome Mark Anthony is gonna try to challenge it and he either Octavian or Mark Anthony is going to die I this is unknown territory for me I don't know what happens so it's gonna be very very interesting to find out with that being said, guys, if you've seen this reaction, realize you are not subscribed. Hit the subscribe button, also please like and share this content because it does wonders for this channel. And I'll see you all next time on Andres Andrea.